lining up the axis rotation of the joint with the axis of the motion or the cam or the, the spindle, the axis here on the machine. My axis rotation of the joint is pretty easy. It's a knee joint right here from the side and the axis of the machine is right through here. There's a little uh, spindle, there's very, very little resistance. This is a hammer strength machine. There's very, very little resistance here. So what I want to do, get myself out of here, uh, is line up my knee joint with that axis. So I scoot myself forward a little bit. The seat is adjustable. And you want to be in a position that when you're fully extended, you're lined up with the axis, but your knees are not hitting any kind of a pad in front of you. Some machines have this, some of them don't. You don't want to grind your patella, your kneecap, down into your, into your knee. Okay, now that my knees are lined up with the axis of rotation of the machine, I want to make sure they stay there during the exercise. And remember Newton's third law, uh, for every action there's an equal and opposite reaction. So if I'm pulling back here with uh, 100 pounds of force, my body's going to tend to go this way with 100 pounds of force, right over the handlebars. Unless I hold on really tight or instead use my seatbelt, because I want to keep the rest of my body uh, pretty much relaxed. So if it has a seatbelt, you, you pretty much want to use it most of the time. And put it on tight. If this is, if this is on uh, too loose, what's going to happen? You're going to move forward a couple of inches, which means your knees are going to uh, move off the axis of rotation of the machine. They're probably going to hit the little pads. You're going to grind your patellas, your kneecaps into your, uh, into your patellar groove and get some kind of chondromalacia or some kind of uh, patellar groove syndrome. So uh, make sure you are uh, properly positioned, seatbelts tight, you're in place, and you're ready to go. Now, the weight on this machine is all on one side of it. There's other pins with, uh, with plates around, but uh, disregard them. Focus just on the weight uh, bar that's gonna be moving during the exercise. Usually there's a handle here you can push forward to, to get yourself into the position. You wanna make sure you get in slowly and safely. Don't try to contort your body and, and uh, tweak a knee uh, before you do the exercise. Okay, so push this forward, get your legs in. Get them in place. Make sure you are still lined up with this uh, uh, with this axis of rotation.